perfect. Now's my chance. All right, guys, Nothing welcome back to more ever. Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. Last That's time good. we left off, we were playing as Vegeta, and we took down um two, uh, and we started the Nam Namekian arc. We took down Kui, we took down Dodoria, we even took down uh, Zarbon. Psych, we didn't really take down Zarbon. He took us down to a certain degree, um, but we still live. Right now, we're going after one of the Dragon Balls as Gohan. Uh, so we're gonna do the usual thing. If we run across an enemy, we don't run away. We we fight them unless they like too overpowered that they can actually one shot us, which is possible here on Hammock. Uh, I did do some level ups as I was um I mean not level ups, some upgrades to the characters when I left and everything the screen. So we're gonna just destroy this spaceship just because we can get some materials. And that's it. Other than that, it's not really that important. Yep. Come on. Come on. Come on. I'm not that strong. Level what? 16? I can beat you. Take. Take. Take this. Get out of here. Get out of here. What you thought. Get out of here, boy. I'm the future savior of the world here. Do you not know who you're messing with? Either way. We're not going to do no side missions. I've done enough of those when I was actually trying to platinum this game. Uh, so, and I did end up platinum in the game. So, um, I do not want to do any more side missions. I've done enough of them. I did everything I could. So, yeah. Uh, the side missions are important to a certain degree if you're looking for D medals. If you need D medals and you can't find them in the overworld, it's good to do uh, the side missions because the side missions can actually provide you with D medals. I guess I would do side missions only because D medals are hard to come across in the regular uh, in the regular overworld. So doing them side missions can actually help when I need to upgrade characters like super moves and everything. That's it. Other than that, I'm not gonna do that many side missions until the cell arc. That's what I'm gonna really need to do side missions. At that point, everything's supposed to be almost towards end game, transformations, uh, super moves, and everything. So, the kid Boo arc, or Boo arc in general, will be the hardest arc in this game where it will give you a challenge. At least when it's the Ma when it's Majin Boo to Super Boo to Kid Boo, those are the two challenges because it can literally like take you take you out almost easily. In my opinion, it did give me a struggle awful. the first time around, but now since I know the ruins. whole butt mechanics, I should be okay with it. When this game came Dragon out Ball. in 2020, I'm not gonna even lie. Oh, search for the search the surrounding area for the Dragon Ball. It's in the water, obviously. Um, I do. I'm watching the anime and all that other good stuff. I, I do enjoy. It's on Crunchyroll for anybody who doesn't know. It's on Crunchyroll. But oh, it's a full star, four star ball. The one that um that you were given on earth. Regardless. Um, what was I saying? But what was it doing in a place like that? I can't remember. Oh yeah. Um that the kid boo arc does give me a trouble. Since I know the button mechanics and everything, I should be okay of getting everything um properly. But I will say this, when this game came out in 2020, I was mm, about it. Was like I wasn't sure how they would implement the whole action RPG oh, element into it. Thought it would be repetitive and everything. But overall, this is the best Dragon Ball Z game Cooper I've ever tank? played <sighs> since Budokai Tenkaichi 3. Budokai Tenkaichi 3 was just a, a fighting world, fighting um, game, arena type fighting game, Dragon Ball Z game. That's, that's like the best uh, Dragon Ball Z game, Budokai Tenkaichi 3. If you're a PS2 native, or you grew up on PS2, you knew for a fact that you had Budokai Tenkaichi 1, 2, and 3. Especially 3. 3 was the best one of them all. And now there's mods that have like Budokai Tenkaichi 4 and whatnot, but those are just mods. I don't mod things, but Budokai Tenkaichi 3 was the best on PS2. Raging Blast 2 was just a um, was just a 
remaster Budokai Tenkaichi 3 or Budokai Tenkaichi in general. But this, this here, I wish they would have um, added as a DLC the Tournament of Power. They do have, I do have the DLCs, the Future of Trunks, uh, the Super Saiyan, the Resurrection F, and um, the Super Saiyan God, Super Super Saiyan Blue thing. So I will be playing those for you guys. But seriously though, if they would have added the Tournament of Power to this game. It would have exceeded the 10 out of 10 rating right then and there. Ban Bankai Napco definitely could still do it, possibly. It's two years. They still have um, updates for... Um, they can't hope to reach my superior level of goals. Still, it might prove... Xenoverse. Xenoverse 2, anyway. They still have updates every now and again for that. So, y'all can do it. Add the tournament of it power to this. Some way, shape, or form. Add it. Just boss. add it. Y'all know y'all could do it. But y'all have millions of other projects too. <laughs> I see y'all been updating that Scarlet Nexus. Which I will be replaying for the channel at a later year. <laughs> at a harder difficulty. Here they are. Yes. Yes, I'm untouchable. This is what you get, Frieza. Your Dragon Balls are finally mine! Now that I have these and the one that I hid underwater that leaves just one to collect, then I'll have all seven! <gasps> this huge power... Is that Zarbon? This was great! I had no idea I had this kind of power! I bet I can make it back to Gohan in no time at all! Oh man, I bet Gohan's gonna get way stronger than me when he meets Guru. The little runt from Earth. Why is he on Namek? <laughs> and he's holding the very last Dragon Ball as well. <laughs> Seems fortune is smiling quite favorably on yours truly today. Oh, damn that Vegeta. Where did he go? Oh, if I don't find oh. him soon, Lord Frieza will have um, my head. Unless you see like a comment Wait, of winner for oh, a prize in the comment you, section. Vegeta then there's still prizes to be given away on the channel. So, uh, if you would like to win a year of Crunchyroll, because I have a dummy account for for a certain occasion, if you want to win a year worth of Crunchyroll, just from the time that you actually answered the trivia question correct, it could be 2022, 2023, uh, answer, this, answer this trivia question for me. Which will One be posted at, at the very end of the First video, possibly, or somewhere in between. Not sure yet. Maybe it'll be a cutscene that I have to do. Let me gather some of these real quick. <laughs> the is as good as dead. All trivia questions are based on the game that I'm playing. Hopefully I've been keeping up with that. If not, then I apologize. But yeah, from here on out, every trivia question will be based on the game that I'm currently playing of some way, shape, or form. Even if it's a, even if it has an anime adaption like this does, obviously. Krillin! Bulma, I told you to hide! It's not safe for you! Is that a Dragon Ball? Wow, those things are huge here. Yeah, I got it from Guru. He's a remarkable person. Oh, yeah, that's right. Where's Gohan? I want to take him to see Guru to increase his power level. He left to go look for the other Dragon Ball. The radar showed one in the village Vegeta attacked before. What? Really? What the? This power? No way! Vegeta! 
You're a long way from home, Earthling. No, oh, no. I was so focused on my increase in power that I didn't notice him. He's not wearing a scouter. And that means... He must have learned how to sense power levels without one. That's a nice Dragon Ball you've got yourself there. It would appear that you and I are after the same thing. <laughs> Fortunately for you, I have some business to take care of before I take it. But I trivia question is this: doing stupid like mm. running away When I... did Goku yeah. achieve Super Saiyan 3? And who did he fight the very first time when he transformed into well, Super Saiyan well, 3? Answer this trivia question, and you'll be able to win Crunchyroll for a whole year. Your foolish actions. Lord Frieza has lost faith in me. If you don't give me the location of the Dragon Balls this instant, I'll just have to beat it out of you. You're welcome to try. <laughs> you never learn, do you? He's let his guard down. Damn, even after all that, I even um got an S rank for that. Remember when I clung to life by a thread? I bet you regret healing me now, don't you? Something to keep in mind. We Saiyans grow stronger every time we're brought to the brink of death. Uh, oh yeah. That's right. Goku keeps getting stronger after each one of his fights. So, Baldy, what's it going to be? You forking over that ball, or am I taking it? Okay, if I give this to you, do you promise just to take it and leave? <laughs> Fine, why not? There's no point in wasting my time with small fries like you once I have the Dragon Ball. 
Finally, I will be the one to rule over the universe, not that foolish Frieza. Immortality will be mine! <laughs> Just let him have all seven Dragon Balls. Come on, Gohan. We're counting on you. Whatever you do, don't let Vegeta find you. I hope Krillin and Bulma are okay. Better hurry. up and hide where to hide where to hide <laughs> where did this power come from all of a sudden but it's gone what's going on here who's there if you don't show yourself right now I'll reduce this place to ashes If it isn't Kakarot's little brat. That's a Dragon Ball. Wait, where did you get that? It was a gift. From that follically challenged friend of yours. Krillin? You killed him, didn't you? No, he's alive. But I'd be more than willing to fix that if you'd like. Huh? And I think I'll let you live. Luckily for you, I'm feeling generous now that I've got all the Dragon Balls. Uh, what's that you've got in your hand there? Oh, uh, this? It's a watch! <laughs> With such primitive technology, I'm surprised you Earthlings managed to make it to a remote planet like this. If you're here, then that must mean Kakarot's here too. No, he isn't! Oh, I see. That's too bad. When you get back to Earth, tell Kakarot something for me. The next time we meet, I'm going to turn him and his precious planet into space dust! <laughs> oh, that was close! Gohan, we knew you could do it! Great job, Gohan! 
We better get out of here, and quickly. Vegeta now knows where to find us. Yeah, I know. I ran into him not too long ago. What? Fortunately, I was able to hide this ball well enough that he didn't find it. Oh, man. You're one lucky kid, you know that? That's enough. Let's get out of here. It's not here. Impossible. It's a straight shot from where that brat was to here and where the Earthling was before. But how? How did he find it? <sighs> that device he was holding. J that wasn't a watch. Damn that little maggot. He took what is rightfully mine and will pay with his life! No! They're gone! Those damn Earthlings, they have no idea who they're messing with! It's only a matter of time before they come after the six Dragon Balls I have at my disposal. And when they do, I'll make them regret ever having crossed me! Krillin and the others were able to secure one of the Dragon Balls from Guru, but it was quickly stolen by Vegeta. But thanks to Gohan's quick thinking, they were able to prevent Vegeta from getting his hands on all seven of them. In order to avoid Vegeta's wrath, the trio had to find a new place to hide. Krillin then made his way back to Guru with Gohan in tow. Freezes ace up his sleeve, the Ginyu Force. <laughs> no way! <laughs> what? We gotta make sure that Vegeta and the others don't find us. Right! in there, Gohan. It's not much longer till we reach Guru. Right! Yeah! <laughs> 
it is. Look. It's on top of that tall mountain. See it? Go on. I'm sensing great power. What? It, it can't be. It's Vegeta. Go on. I'm gonna buy us some time. You hurry on to Guru's place. Uh, okay. Do you have a death wish, Runt? Hand over that Dragon Ball with the four stars on it right now, or face the consequences. What are you talking about? If you won't talk, I'll just have to make you. Hmm, astounding. Um, I heard you can unlock latent power. Indeed, and latent power is something you have in great abundance. However, I sense you also bear some resistance towards it. A full awakening will require some effort. Real sorry, but we're kind of in a hurry. Worry not. I need only time for a few questions. Then I will tap into the power buried deep within you. Now, calm your mind and answer. My boy, what do you think of great power? Yes, to you, power can be a frightening force indeed. But that is not all. I sense you feel its full potential as well. Let us move on. Tell me. When should power be used? Correct. Power must be utilized only when necessary. The final question. Upon gaining power, for what purpose will you fight? Yes, that is why you fight. Think only of this and relax. Okay. Now, I shall begin. What the? There's someone in there. That's where you've hidden the ball, isn't it? No! Wait, Vegeta! Don't! Get lost. I believe answering these There's questions no in a different order. Inside. I did um, my first time around uh, answer it in a different order. It depends. It will affect how much XP Gohan will get. Inside. That must be Kakarot. So he is here after all. What the hell? It's you! How did you increase your power so much? Oh, D Dende, I have a favor to ask of you, my child. Please let the others know there is a large unknown power source approaching the planet. What? Uh, of course! Uh, everyone! Grand Elder Guru says something is approaching the planet! Hey, it's gotta be Goku! Goku's finally here! What? You really think so? It feels like there's more than one. More than one? Wait! That means... One, two, three, four, five. It's energy! Damn it, it has to be the Ginyu Force! I can't believe Frieza actually called the Ginyu Force! G you Give me the Dragon Ball right now! Are you insane? There's no way we're gonna give it to you! Just do it! I won't lay a finger on you once I'm immortal! You have my word! You think we're falling for that? 
Don't you get it? Each member of the Ginyu Force is just as strong as me, maybe even stronger! And there are five of them! They'll hunt us down with their advanced scouters and kill every single one of us! There's only one way to beat them, and that's to give me the ball so I can wish for immortality! The Saiyan may be speaking the truth. There are indeed five evil power sources on their way. Uh, 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 but if we do this, then we came all the way out here for nothing! The Dragon Balls grant the user three wishes. You can still have your wish granted. Three? I thought we only got one wish! If I don't get my wish, then kiss your asses goodbye! Okay, fine. Follow us! But you had better keep your promise! This is crazy! Fly as fast as you can! <laughs> I always did like Vegeta in Dragon Ball Z 2. This man literally is a comedy act. This man always has some sort of roasting line for anybody, and he always calling Goku a clown a f or somebody else a fool or undermining somebody. He don't care how strong you are. You're just going to get clowned, and then he gets put in his place, and then he has his temper tantrum. Seriously, Vegeta. The, the, the character development in, Go, in Vegeta is just perfect. And then we have... God, these weirdos. I've been expecting you. Thank you, sir. Lord Frieza, we humbly await to carry out your orders. The traitorous Vegeta has stolen the Dragon Balls I've gone to great lengths to obtain. Make him suffer for his crime and then bring him to me alive. Consider it done. Scouters have already locked on. We have Vegeta's location. Lil Freezer, he's a scary yordy. Thank you. Now, time for our mission. Men, are you ready for this? Time to talk. We're taking the Dragon Ball. What? What's going on? Was that Vegeta just now? Damn it, they're on the move. This isn't good. They're so fast. I hope we can make it in time. Fast! We didn't even see them coming! D damn it! We were so close! Oh? If I'm not mistaken, that's one of the Dragon Balls, isn't it? The five behind you? Plus the two you're holding? <laughs> that adds up to all seven! Yeah, and you're not getting your purple hands on them! Fine. We'll just have to take them from you then. Guldo! Sir! <laughs> How did he... Damn it! So that tubby 
four-eyed freak actually does have the ability to stop time. Not good. And that's all seven of them. All that's left is to finish you guys off. Vegeta, your suffering will be handled by me personally. Hey, not too bad, Captain. You got to have all the fun last time. Yeah, that's right. Ugh. I suppose you're right. Fine. Raccoon, you take Vegeta. Guldo, you take the two kids. This should be interesting. Aren't I a great captain? Oh, oh, dude, you're the best. In the meantime, I'll deliver the Dragon Balls to Lord Frieza. And then he will finally be able to attain immortality! <laughs> so, Guldo, why don't you finish those pipsqueaks off first, huh? <laughs> This isn't fair. I'm gonna be done with this in no time. All right, here goes nothing. Release your power. Yeah, Gudo, you'll be done with this in no time, huh? Watch when I smack you around like the little tummy thing you are.
Dang, somehow I still got an S for that? Alright, cool. I'm not gonna even complain. How can I? A member of the Ginyu Force be beaten by these kids! Ah, you gotta be kidding me. Whoa! You see that? Gudo just got his butt handed to him! Oh, that's just great! Now that we're down a man, our special fighting pose is going to look ridiculous! Well, I guess Captain Ginyu's gonna have to come up with a new pose that the four of us can do. We did it! Yeah, if we can keep this up until Goku gets here, we should be okay. You two really are off on your own little world, aren't you? Gulda was nothing. He's the weakest of the bunch. The real suffering truly starts now. All right, Vegeta. Now, it's our turn to play. <laughs> you kids can play too if you want. <laughs> Heck, I'll play with all of you. Yeah! 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 
That's the first time Vegeta used Final Flash, and he didn't even name that move yet. Nor was he just, nor was he a Super Saiyan. So that's basically a low graded Final Flash. All right, that was a good warm up. Now let's see what you can really do. Simply magnificent, Captain Ginyu. I must admit, I'm impressed you were able to gather all seven Dragon Balls so quickly. There's no higher honor than such praise from you, Lord Frieza. Oh, ho, 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 ho. it is finally time to turn my dream of immortality into a reality. Let's begin, shall we? Dragon Balls! I command you to grant me immortality and eternal youth! Are you... are you immortal now? Uh, no, I suspect not. Ah, yes. There must be some sort of incantation to activate them. Perhaps some sort of secret phrase that only the Namekians know. Seems I'll have to hunt down more of those worms. Oh? Look at that. I'm picking up three Namekian power signatures. It appears a few of them survived. Lord Frieza, if you would like, I can force the phrase out of them. No, I think I'll ask them myself. You'll do well to remember that I have experience dealing with these primitive creatures. Captain Ginyu, you stay here and keep watch over the Dragon Balls. Understood, Lord Frieza. I won't disappoint you. are nothing but a bunch of pushovers. Well, might as well put the three of you out of your misery. Huh? What was that? Where'd that spaceship come from? It's Goku. He, he finally made it. Attention, we have arrived on planet Namek. I gotta find those three fast. Please be alive, you guys. Please be safe. Goku's heroic arrival. Huh? Go on? And Krillin? They're in trouble! They're hanging on by a thread. They're really close. Right where those three huge powers are. Alright guys, and I'm going to end the gameplay right here. Next time we're going to be playing as Goku, taking on again you force. If you enjoyed the content, leave a like and comment down below. Follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and Twitch at Phoenix D. Wolf. Consider hitting that subscribe button here on YouTube at Lone D. Wolf. Turn on bell notifications so that you can get up-to-date notifications so that I, whenever I go public with a new video, you'll be able to view it firsthand. I love you all, and I'm gone for now.